you heard that he made a video where he, uh, him and his friends, they went to Japan and they went into the forest. You know all this already. I know you know this. They went into what's known as the Japanese suicide forest and they made a video. And you see it was trending. Uh, it was number 10 trending video with si over 6 million views on YouTube, right? So it wasn't like YouTube was trying to uh, suppress this video. They wanted people to see this video, okay? Even though they're pretending like they don't. This was all a big setup. I'm gonna explain why. So, Logan Paul did what he was told. He made this video. And if you look at some of the screenshots from the video, you know, you'll start to see the duping delight. Look at his friend. Look at his faggot ass friend with the shit eating grin on his face. And then uh, his friends, uh, look at this girl over here with the shit eating grin. These motherfuckers. This isn't, people think that they were smiling because they're soulless and they have no feelings. That's not why they're smiling. They're smiling because the video was a big fucking hoax. They know it's bullshit. They're bad actors, so they're smiling. Look at these grins. These aren't the faces of someone who, were, who uh, you know, of people who wandered into the suicide forest and found a, an actual suicide. Bullshit. These are the grins of liars. Look at this girl. See how they try to, they have to cover their mouths? She's trying to cover the grin on her face. Even Logan Paul covering his mouth with his faggot ass friend with the shit eating grin on his face. This was a big setup. This was a big hoax. Logan Paul, the powers that be, YouTube, they're all in on it. The point is, Logan Paul makes this video He's gonna have to take one for the team, right? He's gonna he's gonna take one on the chin for the team, because what happened right after you know this whole uh, video you know charade went down, the video was forced to be deleted, and then YouTube was forced to review their monetization policies, right? So you'll look at this uh, article from uh, Gizmodo headline. YouTube unveils new monetization rules, killing ad revenue for small creators. Okay, now the agenda is starting to be more clear, right? Uh, look at this headline from TechCrunch. YouTube tightens rules. This was all about changing the rules about what videos are suitable for YouTube and what videos are suitable for ad revenue. This was all a staged event. Logan Paul's already back making videos, back in the news. You know, he's 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 gonna spread suicide awareness now. So that was the other thing they got to do. They got to push like this suicide agenda. <coughs> but uh, you know, Logan Paul's really not gonna take that big of a hit from this. It's gonna be the channels that they were really trying to shut down from the start, the truth channels. The independent truth, the independent news channels, those are who they're trying to shut down. And they did it by using this clown Logan Paul in this whole suicide video. Problem, reaction, solution. They created the video. They control Logan Paul. They create this fake ass video where they're all laughing and smiling. This is not how normal people respond to seeing a dead body. Um... They make the video, they attack them for it, and then they propose the solution. And the solution is <clears throat> tighter guidelines, stricter rules. And guess what? Since this event went down, since Logan Paul made headlines for posting his suicide video, you know, his career uh, could take different turns. He could be more, you know, he, maybe he'll become a real actor. I remember, I mean, YouTube Red was building this guy up. YouTube was building this guy up for a very long time. And, uh, I mean, they put him on fucking 60 Minutes. So they want, they needed you to know who he was. They needed the general public, the 60 Minutes viewing crowd, to know who he was before he makes this fake-ass suicide video. That's what it's all about. And, and, and you know what? You know who I hate the most out of all this? Is his faggot-ass friend right there in the peacoat. Fuck you. I hate you more than anybody in this whole video. I don't know why. It's just your stupid fucking smug smile. 
I want to slap it right off your phony face. Seriously. That's all I have to say. I hope you saw this. I hope this was, you know, pretty obvious for anyone who saw the video. And even though YouTube took it down, it's still possible to find this video on the internet. I watched the unedited video, and my first reaction was like, this is total bullshit. You know, and, and I just didn't see, I mean, I don't really watch a lot of YouTube, but like, I didn't see a lot of people talking about it saying it was bullshit. I'm sorry if other truth channels have already come out saying everything I've just said, and I just didn't know they said it, but, um, you know, a lot of us are going to think alike on this. I just, you know, sorry if I'm redundant, if I, if I made a redundant video, but, um, I just, I just wanted to put my two cents out about Logan. This video was fake and it was all part of a, a much bigger agenda to shut down, you know, small independent truth channels. All right, guys, be well.